some of the challenges really, I think, are um, the potential for relapse um, and the, the toxicity themselves, trying to minimize that. Currently, we give these therapies, um, some of these therapies are administered inpatient because of the risk of toxicity. And it would be great if we could move these therapies perhaps into the outpatient setting. Um, there is one CAR T-cell therapy that has been um, given outpatient in, in the clinical trials. Um, and I think that if more of that could be done, um, that would be great. There's also the issue of the manufacturing time and getting these therapies quickly to patients. So often we're talking about patients who have relapsed refractory disease, and they sometimes progress to the point where they can't receive the car even while they're, they're waiting. Um, so the faster manufacturing is, is a better thing if we could, um, I think people are very interested in, in the idea of maybe off the shelf CAR T cells that could be delivered um, more quickly uh, with, with less um, manufacturing interventions, but that's a ways off.